Hi everyone, Dr. Nancy here, and I just wanted to do a little lesson on what's a dandelion and what is not a dandelion. So most of what we have here is some hawksweed, hawksbeard um, uh, plants that uh, people will often confuse with dandelions. And if you were the owner of this lawn, you probably go, oh my God, there's so many dandelions here. But really, none of these are dandelions. So let me show you some some uh, differences between the hawksbeard and the dandelion. Um, the hawksbeard, and I'm going to come down here to this one, often has a branching stem, which is like this one. So even though the flower looks very much like a dandelion, front and back, um, they're actually very different plants. Also, although the hawksbeard is serrated, um, and this, this might actually be hawkweed. The two of them are very close, and um, I usually just call them not dandelions. Um, so you'll see how hairy it is going up the spine there. It's a very serrated leaf, but it's very hairy on the back. Okay, and that's pretty much true of all of these. And looking for that branching. Also, when you break the stem, you know, it, it um, let's see if I can get you a good look there. There's some hollowness to it. Let's see if I can get a good, it's hard to get a good thing. It is a little hollow, um, but there's no milky exudate that comes from it, okay? So I'm going to take this branched um, stem and the leaf with me, and then we're gonna walk over here to a different place. Now this is a dandelion. Um, See, it looks very similar. Um, they look very similar. This is the hawksweed. This is the dandelion. The dandelion's a lot thinner leaf, and there's no hairs growing on the on the back end. Okay, that one's not flowering, but I do have a flowering one over here that I just want to show you all, so you can really get the difference. And when I taught this to my naturopathic students, I would always call them dandelions and not dandelions because we don't really use the hawksweed or hawksbeard very often for um, medicine. All right, so today we have this perfect dandelion. It's growing here by the side of my house. When I saw it, I said I have to make this video. All right, so first of all, let's look at the leaves. They are serrated. Now this particular one is a lot bigger but they're not always. So this is the hawk's beard. Again, it has a hairy, hairy back. Okay. And this is the dandelion. And it has no hairs on its back. Okay. And that's the back of the leaf. And again, if I can get a good picture of this, let's see. You can see there's some hairs there. Okay, hairy back. The flowers look somewhat similar. This one tends to have a little bit more of a stink center. Um, so, um, but it, I think it also, uh, yeah, looks like it has two flowers, ray flowers and disc flowers, like the, um, which is a little more complicated kind of distinction, but um, they, they both have ray flowers and disc flowers, I believe. Now, if you look at the stem of this dandelion, it is not branching. It is one straight stem for one flower. This one, as you recall from the hawksbeard hawkweed, not dandelion group, um, does branch. So the dandelion, true dandelion, will never branch. Now, I'm going to break off this flower, which I'm very sad about because it's so beautiful. But here I go. Oh, I even got splashed. I got splashed by this milky exudate uh, that comes out of the plant, as you can see. Yeah. So, um, also, and you can see here, whoop, the stem is hollow, and you can really push on it and really feel that hollowness. With the hawk's beard, or the not dandelion, when you kind of push on it, it doesn't have a lot of give. It's a lot more rigid, 
and a lot less hollow than the actual dandelion. And look at all that milky exudate coming out of there. That's how you know you got a real dandelion. Okie doke. And such a beautiful flower. It's going to close up now because I pulled it. Um, yeah, they, that's its little crown in back. This one's got slightly less intense one so i'll just let you know okay i'll just let you see those so um yeah that's how you tell the difference see you guys later take care bye